Outside my window, there's a clock tower, frozen in time. This seems an appropriate metaphor for these last 26 days. Every morning I step outside, breathe in the air, and watch the world return to spring. The trees bud, the flowers bloom, the grass begin to darken and green. Watching these moments in nature return with my children is something that I am extremely thankful for. We have tried to maintain a schedule of homeschooling, Zoom meetings, and play, but it's not always easy. We do take time to celebrate our successes however small or large they may be. We cook together. Endless cleaning over and over again. Check in with my students and I realize now more than ever that there is nothing that can take place of the classroom. Seeing my students every day will be even more of a gift than it ever was and I will be thankful to return to the days of classroom settings. craziness that inevitably sits in. We get outside. It is in nature that a sense of normalcy can return. The earth is still going. She will remain. Bond's winning. And as the endless days set on, I try to hold on to these moments seemingly frozen in time. Not to touch the earth, not to see the sun, nothing left to do but run, run. Let's run. Let's run. I am thankful for the time with my husband, for the time with my children, this time to reflect on the small things in life. I am thankful for all of those who put their lives at risk every day for all of us. And I am thankful for my job and my students that we will one day be together again.